I'm Linda Facci of Facci Designs and today I'm going to show you how to make some Halloween treats that look like spiders. So this is a lot of fun to do with the kids. A simple one is to get a chocolate cupcake and I piped chocolate icing on the top to kind of make it look kind of hairy and I put these pocky or pokey sticks, the little chocolate sticks, I put, I push those into the cake on the side. Remember, a spider has eight legs, so four on each side. And then you can use some raspberries for eyes or even uh, some red gumdrops would look cute. I even sprinkled a little um, disco dust on top so it sparkled. It's an edible disco dust. It's a lot of fun. These are made out of like a cake ball recipe. I just used an, uh, a chocolate cupcake and I mixed in some icing and I molded it to a little uh, egg shape. I inserted, oh, he lost a leg. I inserted eight legs made out of black licorice. Then I attached with some frosting in a little pipe bag, I attached a little raisinette for a head. I piped on a little red gel for the eyes and then stuck a little red sprinkle into the eyes. So that's, um, these are really cute and they're tasty. For these over here, this is a no-bake chocolate macaroon recipe. So they stay kind of moist. So it's easy to kind of get the legs in there. So this is a no-bake chocolate macaroon. And for spider legs, I used pretzels. And uh, you can get the pretzel like this and break them apart. And I gave him eight legs. And for a head, I used a junior mint. This one is the also the no-bake chocolate macaroon recipe, but I made little chocolate legs out of melted chocolate in a bag, and then I piped like a number seven on some wax paper. I let it set, and then I inserted him them into the spider. Again, he's got a little junior mint for a head, and you can add the little eyes. These are nonpareils, and uh, you start with one nonpareil, you add a little chocolate frosting, you stick the legs on there, and then you top it with a nonpareil, and then add a little chocolate-covered peanut for a head. Now, for a Halloween treat, I think hamburgers are a treat. So why not have some fun with them? So you have a patty here. Now, I'm gonna, I put my ketchup in a bag. I'm going to cut a hole in this bag. Let's hope this works. Tiny little hole. I'm going to spread it around on the burger and add french fries as legs. What kid doesn't like hamburgers and french fries? So we get four french fries on each side. Top it with a little bit more ketchup, and then I topped it with another hamburger bun. For eyes, you can use a little ketchup, and then how about, the kids might not like this, like this, but you can always take it off. A little pimento olive for the eyes. And on the cheese here, let's draw a spider web. And I think the kids would have a lot of fun doing that. And that's your spider hamburger treat. Whoops. And then you can kind of smash the burger on top and catch the spider in his own web. I'm Linda Fachi for Fachi Designs, and I hope you enjoyed my Halloween treats.